Just like we did for addition, we are now going to look at how we can subtract two-digit numbers by combining everything we've done so far. You know how to do something like 34 subtract 7 really easily now. You put 34 in your head, you want to come back to the nearest multiple of 10, so you know you have to subtract 7 fingers, uh, but to drop to the nearest multiple of 10, you've got to take these 4 off, you'll be left with 30 in your head, but you've still got 3 more fingers to take off, and so you'll end up with your answer of 27. That's what we've done and we've practiced up until now. Now if we want to do something like 84 minus 37, we just need to combine that we've just looked at with subtracting off the tens. Because if we've got to subtract 37, we've got to subtract 30, and then we've got to subtract 7. Well, we know how to do 84 subtract 30. That's just subtracting off tens, so it gets us to 54. And then we have to subtract off 7, and that's what we've just done. We have 54 in our head, and we've got to take away the 7 fingers. We want to drop back to the nearest 10, so we take 4 fingers off to do that. And we'll be left with 50 in our head. We've got 3 more fingers to take off, and we'll get our answer of 47. So, a two-digit minus a two-digit is very easy. We just take away the tens, and then we take away the units in the way we've always done.